Hello and welcome back. This is Double O Debbie and this is actually episode one of season three of my Seven Days to Die Alpha 17 Experimental Branch Let's Play. This is the new update uh, for build 231. Um, my, my last world I had some bugs and I, um, I, I read through the patch notes and I saw that uh, there were some pretty significant changes and we weren't that far in so we might as well just go ahead and, and restart um, to make sure that some of the bugs we received were from the build and not compatibility issues with the build uh, and previous builds. So I wanted to give it a fair shake so I'm going to go ahead and restart. and. This is, uh, I'm calling it Alpha 17 TFP for the Fun Pimps, S3 for Season 3. And that's the name of the world, and it's in North Jacksor Mountains. Um, so that's what we're going to do. I'm going to go ahead and pause the video here while the world loads, and we'll see you in just a minute. Alright, here we go. It's loading up yes <laughs> and here we go a brand new game for build 231 alpha 17 awesome so <laughs> we get to start all over again oh look at that look there's some uh destroyed buildings over there I want nothing to do with right now so we're gonna just do what we do and start punching some grass <laughs> there we go we got enough to build our bedroll now let's go ahead and get that started uh, while we're looking for um, pebbles Oh, this is just so amazing. I think we're going to have to punch this guy to get a little bit of wood. Um, I was reading in the patch notes. Uh, yes, they, they completely redid the perk system. Uh, it is no longer level based or, you know, the perks aren't locked behind levels. Um, which is... I really liked how, how they had it. I thought it was great, but uh, apparently they didn't think so. So, and that's no good. Um, we need to get some stuff. I didn't see any stones on the road. You sh oh, there's one. Usually you see some, uh, they're a lot easier to see on the road. I really like it that I've been starting, um, seems like close to a road a lot. I see a trash over here. Let's get the trash. What's in the trash? Nothing. Okay, we're looking for, we need the cotton too, so let's go ahead and grab it. We're looking for rocks. I see a couple here, but we're also going to go for that garbage in the car too. Oh, I see one there. Let's go grab it. There we go. And we're going to craft our stone axe. Is there not a shovel? Ah, oh, let's just go ahead and craft it. There we go. We're going to craft that up and then, uh... Oh, look, I see a gore block up there. Sweet! So we can get a... We can get a ship. Right off the bat. So let's get our stone axe ready to go and come over here and wow this is really awesome to find that. Oh, I like it. Okay. Uh, so now we need to craft some plant fiber clothes. And 
Bada bing shoes. So, um, yeah, it it's kind of frustrating to to start again so soon. But uh, my husband told me he's like they're they're gonna come up with a new patch in a couple of days, and I was like I, I just completely spaced it out. I didn't even check on it. Uh, so yeah, my my bad. I wasn't totally was unprepared for this update. All right, uh, we got all of them made, so now we need to wear them all. There we go. Let's try and get some rocks. Uh, so that we can make more stone tools. And some arrows, because we're going to need rocks. Um... This totally looks cool. Like this rock is super focused and everything else is sort of unfocused, sort of blurry. Um, I kind of like that. I kind of don't as well. I think that's like a, a video setting. The depth of field. I don't know what what SSA is. I would really like to turn up some of these things and see how well my computer does. I was having um, problems with the last series where it was really laggy in my base and then I'd go away from the base and um, you know, everything was fine. And I heard that these are lag monsters. So let's maybe turn that down and turn uh, some of the other things up. Um... I don't know. Let's try some of the... Okay. Ultra. There we go. Let's see how well we do with this. Let's bring up our frames per second. So now it's like... Uh, 24, 25, maybe I should. Aha, uh -huh, so mining gets you better frame rates. If you just stand in there, yeah, you suck. But if you mine, your frame rates will go up. It's proven. It's on, it's on tape. You saw it. <laughs> be silly if I want. Okay, so it looks like we're teeter-tottering about 30 frames per second with all those settings up, which is really good, um, I think. Oh, it's, it's actually went up to over 30. Nice. So if, uh, if that stays about there, because I wasn't getting much more while I was recording before. Um, so I think that's, that's good. That's really good. So yeah, um, apparently, uh, the fun pimps changed the way the uh, the perk system goes because they don't want people to be godlike at end game and have all of the perks opened up. I can understand that to a point. To me, uh, the battle <laughs> is 
the journey is half the battle. And if you go through this journey and you don't win at the end, what's the point of, of fighting in the first place? That's all I'm saying is that if there's no reward for reaching the, the end game, then why play it to the end game? <laughs> That's what you're supposed to get more and more powerful. Um, but I don't know. I haven't really actually reached the end game for Alpha 17, so I can't really say. And I never really played it. Uh, I think the perk system has made me want to play it. To the end game because I see how it's structured and it's it it gives me a goal to work for I don't just go spawn in and immediately have a forge on day one which I was totally doing in Alpha 16 um, and like I said the journey is half the battle so if if you go on day one and you already have this huge upgrade I mean like, what's the point <laughs> but at the same time, if you you stick with it and you journey, you go through this journey, you should be rewarded at the end, not punished. <laughs> so when, the further you go into this game, the harder it's going to get. So there you have it. Uh, I'm, I'm curious to see how well it plays out. I mean, how much it's going to gimp you. along your journey to the end game. Uh, so we want to make our wooden club follow the quest line. We're going to go ahead and favorite these guys and shorten our list. I just like seeing what's relevant to me uh, at the time, you know. We just kind of hang around this area, harvest some grass. Um, we only found the one bird's nest though, so maybe we want to... I don't want to go towards those buildings, man. They're creeping me out. I, it's like day one, I just got a club. I don't want to battle a horde of zombies on day one. So now we got to craft a bow. And we only have seven feathers. Oh my gosh. That's like no good. There we go. And we need to push R to load that puppy up. And we're done with that part of the quest. Um, oh, we got tons of wood now. So let's get some frames. Let's just go ahead and do ten. That way them on my hot bar. Oh, look, the that frame is floating. Why won't you go further out? There. Yeah, I don't really like that that's floating. Not okay. There we go. Um, I guess we could try to kill this stump. I think that's the, the bird's nest we already looted, yeah. So not a whole lot of bird's nest in this area. Let's go ahead and get our campfire going. Which is no good. And let's look, it looks like um, most of the trees are pine with a few uh, oak mixed in. So this is probably one of the colder biomes. No honey. Oh. And place the campfire. Let's put it there. And we want to leave a bed here. Just so that um, 
If we do die, we, we spawn somewhere other than a random location. Because if you die without a bed, that's where it, what it does. Oh, we're really close to the trader. Awesome. Oh, that's not very far at all. Look at that. That is excellent. Uh, in one of my games, um, like my trader was there, was like a hundred meters away from me. So that was awesome. All right, let's wander off in this direction. Punching stuff. Boom. Oh yeah, we can, we need, oh, there's some birds nests. Two of them. We need those because we need more arrows. I kind of got a feel for, you know, how I like to play. Um, I can melee, but um, I don't know if it was just the incompatibility of the versions um, of my world. What is that? What? Do they? Oh, I, that's right. They have plants underground. I mean, underwater. All right, let's let's keep going. Uh, we gotta get past here. Hopefully, there'll be some. We, we get a. Hopefully, we get a good spot. We had a good spot last time. We did find up, wind up finding another trader. Let's go ahead and um, get some more arrows. How many can we make? We have 43 feathers. Let's just make them all. Holy cow. Did you see that? Uh, we got to get around this lake. It might be better to just go down there and... Oh, wait. Did I see trash? Yes. Aw, who's just some lead? It might be better to come down here and just swim this little stretch to that uh, sort of peninsula. Instead of going all the way around the other way. Oh, look at my... Man, my stamina. My max stamina is tanking. I noticed that in the other uh, game, it seemed to drain a lot faster. But I thought it was just because I was using my bike. But this is... Um, man, I haven't even gotten to the trader and I'm already... Half dead from my stamina. Well, two a third of the way down. Um, I see a POI over there. Looks like it's got a, a water tank. Or is that the trade? No, that's not a trader, is it? like a house a house with the yeah don't well we'll see that might be something we have to go to uh, a nearby POI oh there she is I hear you sister let me get that pick you up you want a flower I got it for you Oh man, I'm so used to get. I'm like, why isn't it 605? I had my uh, awesome goggles, um, nerdy glasses last time. I hope I can find them again. It seems like we're 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 sort of getting less frames per second when we're moving. Oh, I thought I saw a bird's nest. I was like, what? But I didn't. <laughs> Look at the ground while I'm trying to smack you. Oh, out of stamina. Oh, out of stamina again. I see another Zombert over here. 
that our trader over there? I don't think so. That might be some nearby POIs. Dude, so like, I can't run because I gotta save my stamina for the zombies. I suck at melee. Um, let's go to this burned biome and uh, loot this little thing over here. Maybe we'll get lucky and get a little bit of food. No touching. Okay. No. That's that's not the rules. I said no touching. No means no. You too. No. No touching. Touching is bad. You should respect my wishes. Come on, have some food. Oh, few <laughs> bottles. Oh. Seriously. Oh, uh, here's some trash. Three trash in a row. Three is a good number. Actually, there's four. A little bit of cloth. I'm not going to say no to that. Because uh, we actually need the bandages. I see that bird's nest, but it's not going the right way. Uh, I want to get to the trader to s and then scope out the area. And see where we gotta go from there. I'm really concerned about the amount of stamina I have. I mean, I only have the one food. I only start with the one food, and if I can't even run to get to the trader. Oh, look, there he is. Let's see if we can get a honey out of this. They've supposedly reworked all of the damages from the weapons and the tools again, too. Whoa, 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 whoa. I hear you, bubba. Forehead. Oh, you're not forehead. Oh, swing and miss matter. <laughs> Go, bud. Take a nap. Take a nap. No honey. No honey, honey. Oh, Mr. Skater Punk, how is it going? Oh, I'm getting up. <laughs> yeah, oh, it's too tired to do the power attack. Go ahead and loot up this trash. Oh, the loot score! <gasps> oh. I'm sort of disappointed when I see schematics. I mean, I'm excited and disappointed at the same time because you find them early on and you can do absolutely nothing with them. Nothing. So let's look and see. He's got a chemistry set. Oh, it's an actual chemistry set. Nice. And I, oh, why can I get out? Okay, let me go. He's got a workbench that is working. A destroyed cement mixer. That workbench is going to be awesome. Oh, poor little bunny. Can I get to you? Get to you. 
Oh, score. First meet. Oh, it destroyed forge, but the workbench will still help, and we got an anvil out of it. Um, so they changed the perk system that is no longer based off of level. Uh, the, the points are not... Are the, oh, we're getting another one? Where you at, Bun Bun? Bun Bun? Oh, he's caught. I feel so bad, but hungry. Oh, he's going away. Okay, we scared him off. We saved the Bun Bun. All right, let's go see what... Uh, Great weather we've been having. Oh, yeah, it's good weather. I agree. Trader Joel. Mm. Okay, well, at least we have something closer than the buried supplies. Uh, it's just a fetch, so that'll be good. you think you can good. help me with the problem? Brilliant. I guess this kind of makes us friends now. I'm scared. Friends? <laughs> Alright, um, boop boop ba doo what you got, bud? We don't have any dukes. He didn't really have anything to loot. Um, what about this? 48 dukes. Does he really even have anything that we could possibly get? He's got a little bit of wood, 100. Yeah, we just don't have anything to sell. I mean, I guess we could sell the schematic for a hundred, but I mean, we can't do anything with it. <sighs> look at all the stuff and things and we don't have anything to sell. Oh my goodness, look at all that cement he has. That is a crazy amount of cement. Wow. Can you, s oh, you can actually sell eggs. Leather is four, but yeah, I just don't want to sell. We we're in a bad spot. Uh, this guy didn't really have anything to loot, and we can't buy anything. Oh, look at that cobblestone rocks. We would definitely need to buy that. Oh, look, he's even got concrete mix. Wow. So if we get a little bit of money, we might come back and buy that, the, the, the cobblestone rocks, because that is a lot for early on. They want you to buy a hunting knife, huh? Look at that. They got four, five hunting knives. Wow. Okay, so we can't really do Maybe anything next here. next time, happy travels, survivor. All right, yeah, I don't think there's anything else to loot. It looks pretty clean in here for a, you know, a wooden fort. I wish I could loot that coffee, but you can't. All right, let's go deal with these jokers. Well, yeah, we're in a really bad spot. Oh my goodness. What the? Where did all of these guys come from? Oh, and I can't. Hello, Mr. Forehead. Please don't touch me. He has, he sticks his head out and he can reach a lot farther than the other zombies it seems like because he's leaning into it. 
<laughs> and it's a lot harder to hit him without being hit in return. <sighs> All right, I'm gonna have to eat that food. And we're gonna have to find a POI. Whoa! Lady! Please! No touching. No touching. There's a POI over there. I just, man. <laughs> I just want something that might have some food. And that looks more like a, you know, a camp, not a house. I don't know that they camp will have a food for us. I guess I need to drink our water too. Seems like a waste without my, you know, stamina being capped out. Should I be that freaking thirsty with having such a small amount? Oh, I can't. <laughs> I really need to go ahead and turn these guys into bend bendages. So that I don't waste that one if I don't have to. There we go. And we can uh, get another one there of a slot. All right, so let's look at our area. We got this little military camp here and another one down the road. Let's go ahead and make a new bedroll so we can get that ready. And a chest because I hate it when I, I go to settle down and I can't because uh, I'm like completely full. <sighs> okay, I guess we don't we don't really have a choice. We need uh, food. We need food and we need water. We need a pot and I think this has a campfire around it. Maybe there might be a chance that we could get a pot out of it. If not, we'll go down the road. So there's probably going to be vultures, maybe even a dog in here. Look, there's a vulture right there. But before we do this, let's go, let's back up, back up, back up, back up. Because I got a plan. So we got some points to spend. We have four points. Um, I definitely want to do the hidden strike. I think that'll give us an advantage early on. Uh, and nope. Boom headshot. So if we get that headshot, that hidden headshot in, and yeah, we want to actually, I think it might be better to put bump two points in to increase our damage and accuracy. Oh, and now it's two points for that. See, they, they've got it gated behind more points now, which doesn't make a lot of sense to me. Okay, good. Oh! Okay, um, let's bump it up even more. Uh, can we do boom headshot again? Yes. Okay, let's do that. Next time we'll, we'll put more points into agility to hopefully get our hidden strike damage up. I did not see this guy over there. But we need food. Oh, 
Holy... Oh. I was trying to be sneaky. I really liked it that in my, my first season for Alpha 17, when you would hit these guys, it would make a metal clunking sound. Clunk! <laughs> like they were wearing metal armor. That was, that was awesome. Come on, go down, bro. You no go, bro. Oh, okay, let's run away a little bit. Let him approach. I'm hoping there's some food in there. Oh, yeah, 800. 800 for him. Oh, there's a Bernie McBurnerson over there. Did I loot that? Yeah, okay. <laughs> I love it. Um, I hated that when you were like holding on to the right mouse button to zoom in. When you fire that first shot, it zooms out and then you have to let go of the button and press it again to zoom back in. Oh, I aimed a little bit too high. See, like that, now it's not zoomed in. Yeah, there's a dude on the outside. A couple of dudes over here. Uh, we may have to like eat raw eggs if we don't find a pot. Um, see, we could be wasting our time with this POI. We might need to go to that other one over there. But I I do know there is like a, a crate in that big tent. Oh, that looked like it hurt, son. All right, let's go try and get that crate in the big building. Kidding me. Alright, let's melee. Oh, can't get him. Are you kidding me? He's got a freaking Oh, I'm out of stamina. I'm out, I'm out, I'm out. Look at how low my stamina is. I mean, I ate that food and it didn't give me crap. I'm gonna like be out of stamina and dead before night. I mean what happens when you run out of your max stamina? Oh, It's a shamway crate. Oh, yeah. Okay. Maybe we can, uh... Make 
some more bandages. Oh yeah, there we go. That's what I'm talking about. Um. Is that everything? I, I think there's some more tents, but I think they normally they don't have anything in it. Shh, there's a bag over there. Ooh! I have a really hard time hitting the zombies sometimes when they're moving. Yeah, can you just hold those up for me? I'm, I'm trying to do a count. How many arrows can you stick into one zombie? Woo! No touching! Have a strict no touching policy. No touching is allowed. Read the rules. Oh, I feel like I'm backing into a trap here. Oh, swing and a miss better. Stay down. Oh, Jiminy, look. There's so many just wandering around. How am I supposed to do anything? I feel a little bit better. We got a little bit of food in us. Uh, my stamina isn't looking as horrible as it was five minutes ago. I think we still get somebody in that middle tent. And there's a... Come on out. Yeah, come on out. Ooh. Seriously, how did he not set that off? Oh, man. I need water. We only have like, oh my goodness. Oh, he's like coming at me. Oh, power attacked him and it, he just did not phase him. So bad. It is so bad. Um, I'm sorry, Mr. Zombie. I need to go take a little break and do this. <laughs> Zombies are tough. Let's get this tree. I found that a lot of the time that it's the trees in the POI that don't go away. Grab that. Um, I need to repair that while we're waiting. Normally I get my bandages by picking up cotton, but yeah, if you get one of these early POIs, you just tear down a few blocks. Alright, looks like that tree went away. Yeah, I found a, a lot of the times it's the trees that are in the POIs or near the POIs that um, that don't show up properly. Oh, Weather sports bag, be good to me. You are not good to me. You suck. How about you? Oh. disgusted with you. I'm disgusted with you. What about you? It's got a cooler in there, but it's empty. Oh, another sports bag. Oh, nothing. I'm getting hosed. Okay, we already looted that one. A rock just for me. I think sometimes there's a bag here. Oh, four. With nothing. I have been robbed. Okay, so we need water. Um, 
We have cans, um, which without a pot, this can be our only source of water. Back up off my grill, bro. Having some stamina issues here. Yeah, we're gonna have to fill these up unless this next POI is just a pot. Let's see, we had a huge body of water over here and we gotta go that way to get to this POI. Where is that uh, waypoint? Oh, it's off the other direction. All right, we're, we're gonna go check out this POI. Um, yeah, this is on the way to the water. Um, let's, let's go ahead and see about getting some of these golden rods. If we do get a pot, we'll definitely want to make some goldenrod tea if we're going to be scrounging around for our supper. Uh, because if we get food poisoning, we'll definitely we drink the goldenrod tea and we'll get rid of your food poisoning. And that's going to be helpful. Alright, look, they got a workbench in there. There's a gas barrel. I don't know if these can explode anymore or but I definitely don't want it to explode and sometimes there's um stop in here. You gotta be kidding me. Oh, how did that stay? Oh, this is a full... Oh. Yeah, there's a crate in there. Let's... I hope there's no zombies sneaking up. We haven't seen a zombie in here yet. Maybe there's going to be something good in this crate. Like a, an iron tool. That would be awesome. Oh, a hammer. Not as awesome as a pick, but I will definitely take it. Yeah, I don't have anything to increase my thirst. Dude, you think if I did, I wouldn't... good it's just not water I need water there's some trash over here glue I'm supposed to drink glue I guess give you water I might have to drink this toilet water 
Oh, it got me sick. Yikes. Oh, a pot. Okay, that changes everything. And this place looks completely empty, but there is a downstairs. Um, Out of water. Oh, yucca seed. Oh, man. I'm going to scrap that. I don't have the room to hold all the stuff and things. Um. Okay, so we got a little bit of, of food and stuff in us. I hear a zombie. I think it's outside though. Let's go out and look around. What is the sickness that I have? Oh no, I got dysentery! Um, I don't have water. Man, I want to go in. But what does dysentery do for you? What does it do to you? You feel sick to your stomach and have diarrhea. Goldenrod tea may help. Yeah. Okay, here she is. I don't know exactly what is... What does that do to you? Um, it... I don't know. But we do have a pot now, so that is a bonus. Oh, man. What if we go down and there's something really super cool and awesome? I think it would be because the usually let's put this down. No, I said let's put it down. water will want to use that. Oh, come on. I don't want to deal with you dudes right now. And here's the downstairs. Let's go down with our weapon ready. got diarrhea it's probably not a good thing to be hanging around me guys oh I, I don't like it that that light is flickering ominously oh I'm so scared why aren't there zombies where are they Serious? It's just to go over here. Where is this? <laughs> oh, huh. Okay, well, it didn't really go anywhere. Huh, weird. So it was nothing. Okay, so let's go. <laughs> Let's go to the water then. We're wasting our time here. Uh, east. East is the water. Alright, let's get there as quickly as we can. We do have a pot. 
with a little bit of meat that would make one tiny morsel of food. Let's just get to the water, quickly get our bottles filled. And then we'll throw down a campfire, cook it, drink it, <laughs> maybe make a goldenrod tea if we still have the diarrhea problem. We're almost there. Look at how, man, how are you supposed to survive? This is crazy. And it's making me even hungrier having this. I don't know what to do. Oh, and there's a guy here. Look at how low. Okay, the diarrhea just went away. Forehead, back off. Jiminy Christmas, I can't just calm down, relax. All right, completely ignore everything else. Get the freaking water. Uh, I think we can cook one bacon and egg. We have enough meat for one bacon and egg. I haven't seen an animal to kill it other than the bunny rabbit. Oh, and we can't actually make the bacon and eggs. We have to spin the point. Do we even have a point? We don't have a point. So we can't make the bacon and eggs. Which means we're going to get stuck with even worse food. Oh, and I can't make the goldenrod tea. So, hurrah! We can't make the thing that would keep us from getting dysentery again. <laughs> Let's go ahead and get some more water. Um, I guess we can scrap these empty cans. Let's just make it, I guess. Oh, this is horrible. Um, does this... So you can't actually you can't actually drink the grain alcohol. What a shame. Because you know it is drinkable. Okay. Um 
Yeah, that's not worth eating. I think you can eat raw eggs, but there is a chance of food poisoning, which is no good. Oh, we're in dire straits here. you can eat raw I mean you can't even boil an egg without that point so I don't want to get food poisoning though that ain't no joke all right I don't know how I'm gonna get out of this Uh, we definitely want to settle somewhere nearby the water, though. Um, we're still pretty hungry. Let's go kill that zombie. Uh, there's a couple of zombies. Thought of making trouble in my neighborhood. <laughs> Maybe we can get a level so we can cook. We can cook the tea and the bacon and eggs. Because apparently they. The world wants us dead. Holy cow. I got you and I got you too. Oh, I hate that I power attack the grass. You're kidding, right? <sighs> All right, this, um, this clearing over here, I guess, looks as good as any. To settle. It's close to the water, uh, but not close enough for the water to be an issue, I guess. Uh, well, maybe it might. So maybe we might want to go further in. Like in between these two trees. Is that where we came from? Or is that where we came from? I think we came from the west. So yeah, we came from this one. So this is actually a new POI. Um, I don't think we really have a choice. Let's... um. <coughs> Set our bedroll down here. Put a storage chest. And throw some of this stuff in here. That we might not immediately need. Yeah. 
and we'll go check out this one to the south. We're a little bit less encumbered. We can move faster. It'll take us less energy to get there. Oh, I thought I saw a bird's nest. Where you at, Sombro? I don't see him. Hold on a second. some food, people. Sarah, there's like no ladder to get up there. some lag here. <sighs> this is nerve-wracking that the food situation is so bad. All right, um, let's see, I see a bookshelf in there. <sighs> yeah, this is, this is ridiculous. This is almost unplayable with it draining the stamina so badly. There's a grill in there. I hope there's food. Nobody keep food around anymore. There's a basket on top. <sighs> okay. Look, there's a. Oh, let's loot this and nobody. Oh, there's a down. But I think there's um there's a sombro in the cabinet. disturb anybody else. 43 stamina. <laughs> Come on, give me your big experience. Crazy. Yeah. 
should be able to cook in that. All right. Um, I can make um, boiled eggs. Actually, what I want is, can I not make the goldenrod tea? Son of a biscuit eater. I am so frazzled. Let's just make one. Because the goldenrod isn't that, um, Common. We want to make sure we use it very sparingly. Um, the bad thing is the boiled eggs uses a water bottle. I know I can fill them up, but if they're gone, I can't. So what I might do is I might make a couple of these, but then uh, save it. Can I? Oh man, this is crazy. Come on, give me something good to eat. I'm gonna pick that red tea. I think that guy is outside. All right. Oh, there he is. Oh, hey, there's there's a ladder up there. Too much stamina. All right, let's um, let's eat a couple of raw eggs now that we have. Oh, we got sick. I'm gonna eat two more. If it turns into food poisoning, I have the golden rod tea, so that's good. All right, we're good. Um, let's see if there's anything else. Broken workbench. Put some wood in it. Thank you. Some garbage. Thank you. Oh. Forehead. <coughs> You're kidding me. Doesn't look. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, there's an up. Oh, 
I thought that was a zombie. Okay. There's probably one up there. There's like nothing here. This look, looks like a death trap with a fake floor. <laughs> I see you. Seriously? happen. Alright, I want to go back up. Um, I think there might be something over there. <laughs> I did it! No! I was so proud of myself and now I failed. Alright, let's do this and that. Oh, I thought maybe there was something, uh, some mute over there, but there's not. There's like nothing here. Uh, is there something behind all of this stuff? Nada. <laughs> what about out here? Oh, this is the interrance. There's like nothing in here to loot. <laughs> I'm disappointed. There's no way to go. I'm supposed to go over here. And then we're on the roof of this place. Oh, look. There's one single suitcase. It's with nothing in it. What a crappy, crappy place. I think we still have underground to explore. There's an underground section. Seriously, I can't kill one freaking zombie on a bar of stamina. This is getting very frustrating. stuff and things. Did I use all of my... Alright, we'll have to make more. I 
see him over there, but I don't think I'm going to be able to get down without um, causing him to wake up. Yeah. Oh, he's a crawler. Don't you hit that bag. Don't you hit it. It looks like there might be something else over there, too. Oh, look at all. Oh, that's what I'm talking about. Ah, oh, yes. Yes. Okay, um... This was a good find. I'm so glad. I don't know if I should be quiet. I don't know if there's something else in that other room. Um, it's already past the time I would normally call it, but I want to see what's in these crates. A sham. Oh, meat stew. Yes. Awesome to get that meat stew. Here's another shamway. We're already like. Oh, the meat stew is filling us up on hydration too, because it it adds water. Sham sandwiches that aren't a lot good to us right now. Is there? Is that a bag? It's not anything lootable. <laughs> and a shotgun Messiah crate that we have to open because it's more than likely going to have weapons or guns. Uh, weapons, guns, ammo. Ammo. So it looks like... <laughs> Is another section. Interesting. Can we get through? We can. There's a suitcase down there. We're still like, um, uh, a little bit down on the thirst, so let's go ahead and use the water. There we go. That'll help our stamina recovery a little bit. Oh, are you kidding me? Awesome. Okay. Well, I think this goes outside. Pretty sure this was leaning up against the house, so this was like the entrance to it. And then they, uh, oh, look at that! <laughs> so uh, I'm probably gonna try to hold up here since I don't really have. I uh, spent all the time worrying about food and drink where I couldn't really gather that much so uh, I'm probably just gonna try to make it through the night here um, maybe I'll go in this other room and uh, 
Well, see, this is a thing. Because um, you can't crouch and jump at the same time. So we need to get... There we go. Awesome. Oh, shh. What I'd like to do is... Chop away this top ladder right here and put a frame there. There we go. Come on, you can do it. There we go. Okay. There we go. Okay. We're going to go ahead and call the episode here. We'll pick up tomorrow. Anyway, uh, thank you for watching, and we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.